I have a Frigidaire dishwasher that I can't get out of PF equals power failure error. It seems like the problem with this brand is the control board. I was hoping it isn't that since they run around 140. Is there any way to reset the unit besides unplugging it and plugging back? Maybe a secret button that clears this error out. The manual says press start slash cancel button but that doesn't do it. I tried to cycle the power. Tried to clear out the PF error by pressing the start slash cancel button. Tied to hold down air dry button and start slash cancel button for 3 seconds. Still just flashes PF. If pressing the cancel button doesn't get rid of the power failure error PF then you have a bad control board. So you will need to replace the control board itself. Here is a link to the part. This is the best price the on the board I could find. Most people want about $140 but Sears only wants $93. Click here. Are these control boards a bad design or what? If I buy another one it will probably just fail again down the road or did they upgrade them to not fail? It seems from everything I have read about these dishwasher it is almost always the control board. Is it even worth throwing more money into it? What else will break on it? Well the drain pumps commonly go bad, but yes the boards go bad often too. Again you're only reading reviews of people that are upset because their appliance broke, so it's not that the units break a lot, it's that when they do it's usually the control board. This is common with many appliances. Nonetheless, I'd say it's still worth fixing at this time as the unit really isn't that old and I doubt if the issue comes back in the future. Does the touch panel ever fail? Oh yeah, but not on your model. Some models they fail all the time. Okay so I order the control board. Let's hope that is the only thing wrong with it. Alright best of luck, it should be. If the touchpad was bad you'd have more than just the PF flashing, you'd have a lot of lights flashing. Okay so I installed the new control board and it does the same thing as the, the old control board. Flashes PF Upon press every button the ULIT made scrub button final did something. It then gave me a flashing DC. Door close is all right close. So I open it and it changes to do, door open. After closing the door again the display flashes 32. After I couldn't do anything else will it I switched back to the old control board and tried the same steps. It did the same thing with the ULIT made scrub button and then the DC and do message the flashes 27. So, what else can be wrong? Or did they send me a bad board to go with the other bad board I already got? Do in DC when it flashes means the touchpad is bad actually. As I said, when the touchpad shorts out all sorts of things will flash like DC do PF 31 35 27. It sounds like water or steam may have gotten into your control panel to short out more than just one part. So I need order a new touchpad too? How much does that run? And my control panel might not even be bad? The control panel is $93 here is the link. Click here as far as the board I can't say for certain if it's bad or not, if it was only giving the PF error before and now it's giving lots of display issues then it sounds like you just have two bad components. 
If you have a home improvement or appliance question and want to chat with an expert now visit justanswer.com slash YTHI.